one, we're gonna try out a new hack. This is the Mega Man 2 sliding and charging hack from Kuja Killer. Hey, excuse my stuffy nose tonight. You can find it at the link I just posted in the chat. This this hack is from Kuja Killer. Um, this has a sliding and Mega Buster charging charging component to Mega Man 2, which I tried I tried this out earlier and it's it's a game changer. The sliding the sliding component is based on the physics of Mega Man 3, and the charge shot is the is the big ball of and well, the big ball of energy shot from Mega Man 5. And you can also select your weapon without having to go into the subscreen by hitting select. Now, what I ended up doing was I, when I patched this, I had I still have the I still have the um, patch for Mega Man 2, which is the, with the don't lose e, don't lose your E tanks after a game over patch and patch attached. So, so I ended up trying to patch it on top of that, and it worked perfectly. So there's something I can add to my little mini review on my blog, and along with romhacking.net, I don't recommend trying this with the Mega Man Mega Mix hack though. I did try that earlier. Sad face. So I think with this, I'm going to try to um, Mega Buster most of the bosses and, you know, use their weaknesses here and there too. Depending on how late it is afterwards, I may give Strider 1 a quick try for the first level because I fit because I pushed around with EPSXE's settings and got and got one of the video and got one of the updated video codecs to um fix up to fix up the PlayStation graphics. And I didn't want to mention this in that little opening, but we hit 500. I finally hit 500 followers tonight. Yeah, that good game lad is for me for hitting 500 followers. I think Saturday night. I think Saturday night. Um, I mean not Saturday. Sunday night. I'm going to try for the 500 followers bad game night, starting with a week of Goldfield and randomizing 11 and randomizing 11 others. Games are going to be ones that people uh, people suggesting I play and ones that little mixer has been playing and suffering through over the past while. Hey, Kuja Killer, how's it going? Alright, so let's just <clears throat> let's give Kuja Killer a quick shout out. And let's give Little Mixer a quick shout out also, since he's kind of my inspiration behind doing the really bad games for 500 followers. And let's begin this. Alright, so I'm going to go the normal route that I always did during, um, during my, uh, the other Mega Man streams for hacks and <clears throat> during, uh, whatchamacallit, during Mega March for Rochan, starting with Flashman. Trying to watch Casual Tom 82 right now, but so you are. Oh, sweet. What's Tom playing tonight anyway? Ooh, I like this. Oh, sweet. I like that slide on the uh, icy force. I don't stream never in my life before. Oh, I'm sorry.
So yeah, anybody in chat, if you got questions for Ku for Kuja Killer, feel free to ask him while he's here. This guy can go F off. Looking at war. Yeah, I'm not going, going to try for that. Woohoo, I actually made it this time. Oopsie. Come on, stop sliding. This is my first, this is actually my first time fully playing this. I've been, I've been trying this out off and on over the, over the course of the afternoon. Okay, I didn't think I was going to win that. Thank you for playing this, it means a lot to me, of course. I enjoy, I enjoy trying out I enjoy trying out new hacks and RPG hacks. I got into playing RPG hacks when I discovered nice. Return of the Dark Sorcerer and it kinda nice. and it kinda spiraled nice. from there. Thanks for the nice Chris four seventy four and welcome back to the wonderful world of Twitch. One of these days, I still need to do a full playthrough of Dark Sorcerer. And Divergent Paths, for that matter. And Effort for Ultima. And Tom is playing SNES Final Fantasy Hack, hack right now. Oh, cool. Yeah, yeah, like me, Tom really enjoys his... E really enjoys his FF6 hacks. This music is still the bomb, Diggly. Okay. Oh, I know it, Chris. I am Mega Man. Diversion path was, was fun. Yeah, you were sitting. Yeah, you were saying that in uh, your DMs. That was actually another one I I enjoyed doing a hack showcase for. Whoops. Yeah, how far are you in Diversion Paths, anyway? Or did you finish it? Ow. But yeah, anybody jo joining us, I'm um, trying out Kuja Killer's sliding and charging ha hack for Mega Man 2. I did discover that this hack works perf works perfectly if you have the have the don't lose E tanks at game over actions patch attached to your 
your Meg Man Chew ROM. And I also discovered it doesn't work with Mega Man Mega Mech. I mean Mega Man 2 Mega Mix. Finish diversion path. Oh nice. They're not even touching that E tank. Ow. Yeah, I'm probably not going to be able to get a good, good slide screenshot here. The E tank one. I think that was one of the first ones that I discovered that I discovered. The whole thing with uh losing E tanks with with uh Mega Man 2 is one of those one of those bunk glitches. Also have to excuse me. I'm also taking screenshots while I play to th to throw up a little mini review of this on my blog. But uh, yeah, the whole E tank, <clears throat> the whole E tanks thing is kind of kind of a glitch. I hit the right button. Yes. It's kind of, kind of a glitch, kind of like with Ninja Gaiden One. If you loot, if um, you game over, if you game over, uh, fighting the front, the final three bosses, you you're stuck all the way back at six one on that on that bridge from hell. And for the good game lad, oh god. God damn it. But yeah, tomorrow I'm gonna to try again. Uh, I'm gonna try again tomorrow with uh, Strider and Strider 2. Yeah, I think the first hack I discovered was Return of the Dark Sorcerer, and it kind of, and it, you know, kind of went from there, discovering other hacks for Mega Man, Ninja Gaiden, other RPGs, and then I really got into things besides with Dark Sorcerer when I discovered the FF4 FF Ultima hack. And joined 8-Bit Fans Discord for it. Which is also where I met met Casual Tom. Bad fishy. Go to hell. You go to hell and you die. Actually, more surprised I'm still alive. I knew that was going to happen. 
especially seeing how I usually usually use the metal blade for like 80% of Megman 2. Super Pico land in 1998. <coughs> nice. Please stop sliding. Were the graphics only hack of Game Boy Mario 1 with the enemies turned into Pokemon? Ooh, neat. I've actually played some ridiculous hacks hacks uh, myself. Bubsy in Streets of Rage 2, for example. Yes, that actually does exist. <laughs> um, okay, who do I usually smack down next? Now, you know what? Screw it. Let's go for Airman. Best PUBG game ever. I... Honestly, I do agree. Also the... Also the least jankiest PUBG game ever. Yeah, basically, Bubsy in Streets of Rage 2, imagine Bubsy taking on Mr. X's forces and street fighting, street fighting in Streets of Rage 2, and, ow. And, that's pretty much your hack. First ever Mega Man hack experience was whoopsie. I should be paying attention. Rockman 2 Exile. Mm. Yeah, the most recent Mega Man hack I played was Rockman 3 Claw, and for with two times recommendation, and that hack kicked my butt. Ow. And that was and that was even with with um. Knowing the knowing the boss order and starting with nine energy tanks. I will say though, I really had a good time I really did have a good time playing Rockman 3 Floor. Extremely well whoopsie. Extremely well done hack. This fan guy. Oh my god. Oh my. I got lucky there that it, I didn't fall into the abyss. Well, that was fast. Oh yeah, the to for the top quality. Top quality and Oh, that is, but I might I might try claw two sometime. I was also really impressed with claw with um the music choices in in claw three. I was I was more surprised that information high for Mac was. From Mac Plus Plus was playing in a couple of the Wiley stages. Alright, well, I guess we'll do Flashman next. I mean, Quickman. Which is probably where I'll normally be our first war, and I'll likely be raging over the themes. 
Alright, let's... Alright, that's not what I wanted, but I'll take it. That's three. It's actually looking like the, sli the sliding will definitely come in handy in the second portion. I like that. Uh, you know what, Scorch? We're going to do that. I honestly don't entirely remember how to do this. Yep. Especially since it's been, it, it, especially since it's been a while since I played Mega Man 2. I think, I think last time I played, I played this was, uh, was, was the, was Will Chan 2 back in March. Uh, if I have to, whoa, damage. Uh, if I have to use the flash stop, right, bro. I got three energy tanks. And no lives. Cool. See if I can take out Pikmin before I before I get a uh, game over. Oh wow! This actually does some really good damage to Pikmin. Hey, Kaka Lucola, long time no see, buddy. find my mouse. Kaka Lakola, <clears throat> the master of Dong Dong Never Die. Alright, let's go for Heat Man next. Thanks for the shadow. What was where Crick Man lived up to his name? Yeah, he died quickly. Alright, let's give it. Alright, let's do Zippo Man. Alright, that's the bubbles. So my fav my favorite Mega Man 3 hack hack is is still probably the Mega Man 3 improvement hack. Oh, 
but so nice that all oh, this is strong enough to come back to me. Well, I'm probably, I'm um, pretty sure everything's going to fall apart once I hit. Once I hit widely, like always. Do you remember a series of flash animation from the early 2004's Wiley shorts? Nope. I got logged out of it and my phone is not active now. Can't log in. Oh. I hate this section so much. Okay, that's okay. I kind of needed to game over at some point. One of the shorts was about Riley inventing a pair of robot bosses called Flame Man and Gas Man. It was an explosive combination. And that will teach me to be chat. Did it, did it, did it, did I should probably switch back. And yeah, um, like I mentioned a couple times before, I'm playing this hack with the with the don't lose E tanks uh, game over patch attached to, which does work. And as you can see, I game over then I still got my E's. Okay, now I'm starting to suck. Know what? Really didn't expect to start screwing up in Eatman stage, but that's where we're at. Next stream, next stream I'm going to try again at finishing Strider, the first Strider game, and then do another run of Strider 2 with Strider Hein, since we unlocked him. And I finally hit, and I finally hit 500 followers, so... So I'm hoping Sunday night I'm going to do the my 500 followers really bad game extravaganza. It's only with everybody's favorite a week of golf fuel. Nice, nice, nice. nice. Which Rider game? Okay, Ness. Um, I'm doing. I'm doing the PlayStation port of Strider 1 because I finished Strider 2 for full PlayStation the other night. And if I finish Strider 1, I can unlock the the double the the double zero prologue stage for Strider 2. And that's if I get through the anti gravity portion of stage 5. After Strider 1 and 2, I'm going to give uh, the next Strider uh, a shot. Volley Bear Kid Cool. Volley Bear is on the list. I, th I think. And honestly, after I fit after I finish this, I do have a retro playlist. I do have a retro playlist made up made up, so I actually can. And show everybody. Okay, where's the number two spot?
Nat, that could look cool. Like I said, I'm stick. I'm doing the um the PlayStation one one since I can unlock stuff. I had originally. I was originally doing Strider one arcade and Strider two PlayStation until I learned things. Yeah, you know the number two spot. Where the poop goes. Okay, Zippo Man was still easy. And no Kakalukola, Bubsy 1 and 2 on on part of it. I'm, uh, he mostly curried, curried games that Little Mixer forced him, was forced to play and a few others that people suggested. Funny thing is I got my PlayStation chip to play DBZ Legends which Strider 2 detected and wouldn't boot because of the mod chip. But I had to buy a Game Shark just to play the US Strider 2 on my chip US PlayStation. Yikes. I've never heard of that game, Hakula Cola. Was it made by the same people who did Ding Dong Never Dies? Okay, let's take out Woody. Okay, three mega buster shots on on the doggies. That's not bad. Imagine a verse version of Bubsy. Is that possible? Is that humanly possible, Cackle Cola? If it is possible, why? Oh wow, one shot kills the monkeys. It's a game I can only recommend checking out the first few levels or until the awesomeness gets on your nerves. Oh, kind of like Cheetah Man too. Hey, welcome back, Kuja. Uh, which one? Oh. Screw this, I'm using the broken blade. And I got chickened. Most impossible is like the if the developers watch the Sonic TV ads for a few minutes. Oh my god. Nice that everything's starting to come back to me now playing Mega Man 2.
Oh, to watch two streams at the same time. Been there. Typed a reply in the wrong chat. Oh, I've done that too. Uh, it's F5. No, F is flashing. Right, let's see if I remember this. I do. It was a sweary reply in a family-friendly chat. I apologize then and explain myself. Was it Red Ox? Okay, let's jam out to this music, everyone. I also really need uh, oh, some extra lives. How many tanks do I have? Oh, I only have two. So how's everyone doing? I was actually really surprised. Oopsie. I was also most surprised when I logged in to watch Golden earlier and saw that I finally hit 500 followers. Here is the extra life. Thank <laughs> you. 
Hey, Garrett, how's it going? So what's your secret 500 follow stream plan? Really bad games. Starting with a week of golf field and going through a list of 11 others specifically curated specifically curated to make <clears throat> to make me rage and whatnot. I've got some games that people suggested and honestly a lot of them are, are some of the really bad ones that Mixer has been playing. 24 hour dong dong never die stream? I wish. Oh speaking of speaking of which I actually might be able to play play that. No wait, I was having gamepad issues with it. Never mind. Double Dragon for the 2600, never again. And yes, Garrett, Althena is on that list, actually. Garrett's another great streamer. Give him a follow if you if you're not already. So is Chris 474 when he's able to log on to Twitch. And Kaka Lakola plays some really interesting games from Dong Dong Never Dies to the Super Star Wars games and Street Fighter the Street Fighter the movie the game. If you're looking for a bad game to rage at, Awesome Possum is a good choice. Oh boy. Oh boy, we're off to Wiley. And here's his boner palace. And this is probably when most of this run's going to start falling apart. So if you guys are interested in this hack, I don't know where the hell where the hell my mouse is. Check it out here. The developer of this hack, Kuja Killer, is in, in chat right now if you've got any questions or comments. Really nice guy. He doesn't bite. Ooh, a one up. Yeah, try sliding in the little ceiling before the first ladder. Okay. Oh, I keep forgetting I can do this. I probably should have used three. This music's such a jam. You mean this? Meat! Hey, Simon, how's it going? Okay, Simon, you get to see the eight robot masters again once I get up to the force rush. Now for my whoopsie. Now for my least favorite part of this stage. Well, one of my two least favorite parts. So yeah, guys, Gary C O W is celebrating his birthday month. So give him a follow and check out his birthday streams where he shares a, a number of games he enjoyed or he enjoyed when he was growing up.
Okay, I'm gonna probably end up dying somewhere around here. Like I always do. Okay, I gotta stop doing it. Honestly, if I make it through the dragon on my first try, I will be very surprised. Or maybe not. Of course, I didn't even have a chance to try a Mega Buster shot on him. Better do that just just in case. Yeah, I know, Chris. I know. Just as bad as my as my free falling in in Strider. Thanks for clipping that and not telling me, by the way. Before we continue, let's give Simon a shout out. And this is pretty much how I just felt right now. And why do I still have the broken blades up? This does nice damage. Neat. And for the GGs. So yeah, also in other in other news, I. I sort of I sort of met I sort of mentioned it on Twitter. I think I'm close to a payout. So if I can if I can manage that that um if I can manage a payout in April in in April I'm going to finally try to get some new glasses and an eye exam. Ow. I gotta remember what what the hell do over here. Other than dying. Whoa! I was too close. Oh wow, I actually remembered how to do that this time. That's actually amazing. You know, I can't help but think of the Giant Robot Dragon vs. Gi Giant Robot Queen Elizabeth first fight. Wait, what? Okay, Broken Blade time. Treat the clip to you, you might even recognize the voice that you. Oh my. You really do scare me sometimes, Cackle Cola. Anything else need to be up? Up? No. What am I even doing? Thank <laughs> you. 
Yes, that went through. Finally. Finally, I have a screenshot. Okay, let's flash these. Bubbles, aren't I? Yep. I'm gonna die. I didn't expect you died like that. I'll recharge my flash. I mean, worst case, I'll use an energy tank against that boss. I I have no shame. Ow. Broken blades. Upgrade miner, fire, meat, seltzer, ew. Uh, flash. I just said it to you three times just because the MM4 through 6 did it like that. That's why I put in the notes how people can edit the damage tables. Ooh. Yeah, Kuja, I saw that I saw that in your notes too. Honestly, I'm also more surprised I've only used a and I think I've only ow using energy to I think I've only used an energy tank once before, using one just now. Which is actually pretty good consi considering how often I end up using them in Mega Man 3. You fuckers. Hi, I did not expect to hit a wall wall here. That's for damn sure. Yeah, exactly, Chris. I deserve that disapproval. Immensely. Yeah. 
Yes, I mean, the, blo the blocks want you to say... Oh, okay. Yeah, the blocks want you to say hello there to me. Or they both just said hello and goodbye like the Grand In Inquisitor to me. Alright, well now I'm going to be stuck using a en energy tank again. this was and I'm pretty sure my next wall is going to be the boo beams that's for the good game lad I usually need the e-tank for the dirt boss so you need the crash bomb to defeat Space. I mean there's actually a trick to avoid taking damage there which I'll show off once we get over there Uh, I'll be charging my flash. Nope, it's got stores of time. Oh, even more fun. And honestly, if if and when I do do lose fighting the boo, fighting the blue beams boss. I, I know the f I know the farming spot. Now we're in Wiley Sewer. and easy. Stay in the middle. Don't touch the spikes. I forgot how fast that stage was. Alright, let's try the Mega Buster on Betsy Boy. Two. Three. Four. Nice. Coming up next, Boo Beams. Much Boo, many Beams. Okay, what? Alright, I do need to do that for Alien Wiley at least. Um, I will need that. How many lives do I have anyway? 
Okay, I still got a good, I, I still got a tasty amount. Okay, time to find the hole. God, I forgot this is here. What the hell just happened? Am I on the ladder? Snazzy. And honestly, I I did learn the 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 um. I know I did learn the the uh, blue beams trick a while ago. I'm just trying to get through this. Oh god. Oh god, fuck everything. And here's everyone's favorite boss. Boobeam Bob. So yeah, Simon, if you if you um keep hitting stall right when you're going to get hit, you don't get hit. Or that could happen. Crap, we're gonna have Actually, you know what? I'm on my last life. Let's just game over and try again. You touch it instead of touching grass, I'll touch spikes. Hey, sexual Senna, how's it going? I'm doing pretty good, actually. 
Uber truck girl trying out the Mega Man sliding and charging hack from Kuja Killer tonight. We've had a few slip ups in Wily's Castle, but everything's going pretty good so far. Except for the Blue Beams boss. I look here often. Good. I enjoy lurkers. Feel free to um feel free to chat it up here with us anytime. What am I doing? Okay, let's try this again. I played Meg Man on Game Boy. You know, I still got. I still need to sit down and play those. I was going to play. I was going to play the five of them during Mega March, but but numerous things got in the way. And I do love the X series too. Once I finish Mega Man 8 during my Mega Man Derusting series, I'm going to be switching over to the X series with with X1 to with X1 through 4. X X3 is the one I'm dreading the most. That's gonna probably be a hell of a lot of aging. Oh, whoops. Don't jump, Kane. Take it easy. Just treat the metal blade like a woman. Yeah, back, yeah, basically back in March I was playing all the Mega Man, all the Mega Man games. I, I started Mega Man playing the, playing the Rochan hacks of Mega Man 1 through 6. I played, uh, what the hell was it? Maverick, Maverick Hunter X and... Whatever and Mega Man powered up for PSP and a couple other, a couple other doozies. Dang, I took the damage. Okay, here's where I need to concentrate. you're doing is messing up the software and causing the glitches like the code. Alright, so basically this is the sliding and charging hack for Mega Man 2. This adds a the the Mega Slide flaw that was created from Mega Man 3 onward and the and the Mega Buster from 
Oh, uh, and the Mega Buster from Mega Man 5. I'm also playing this. I'm also playing this hack with the the don't lose e don't lose e tanks when when you get a game over over patch attached to this also, which which surprisingly worked too. I I if you've been here long enough, you know I play a number of different hacks. Hey everyone, I'm back. We're just finishing off the Mega Man. Do sliding and charging hack. Thanks everyone for joining me so far. And this has actually been a pretty good run of Mega Man 2. Wait for a few issues here and there. Come on, throw your white stuff. Honestly, having the slide fight while fighting Air Man is definitely, definitely a bit of a game changer. Just like when you fight him, fight him as the Dark Robot in three. Yeah, Gary, were you here when I was playing the Mega Man 2 randomizer, and Heat Man's fire was white? Wow, I don't know how I managed to win that fight. Sorry, I'm looking at Tom still haven't been paying attention the last 10 minutes. Oh, Tom's still on? Did someone forget to spike up Bubble Man's room? Probably. Alright, you know what? I don't need the flash anymore. I probably will have to use an energy tank. Oh, maybe not. I don't know how I managed to win that fight either. Does the Mega Man Mega Buster make Mega Man too easy as long as you have it? No longer have to worry about which boss right? Eh, in a way, it's it's kind of like it's kind of like with the later Mega Man games with four through six, where yet yeah, where yeah having their weak having their weakness weapons does help does help a lot, but the Mega Buster sort of compensates for it in a way. Yeah, this fight's not going to be close though. You know what? Screw this. Or not. Look, man, Metal Man just like just enjoys exercising and running in place, okay? Leave him alone. He's fucking metal, man. And now here's where things get interesting. Oh wow, I can use it on Wily's machine. I tank time.
and why they escaped. Maybe because he's just Metal Man? Now if he was Speed Metal Man, he'd be zipping around all over the place. Oh, I'm busting him them all up, Simon. Bust me. Thanks for the good game, lad. I wonder if the Mega Buster will work on Ailing Wily. Oh my god, it, Wily's an alien! That explains a lot. Oh, wow, he just absorbs my shots. Interesting. Okay, time to bubble him. Or not. That's okay, we just learned something. How many lives? Oh. Oop, I'm on my last life. I guess that's to know then. Oh, crap. And that's okay, I usually use a energy tank during the alien fight anyway. Oh, that's a good point, Simon. I never thought of that. Good call. I even hit him that time. Let's see who dies first. And Wily's down. Time for Flashy Flashy. And I broke Wily's new toy. Wiley should really stop buying things from Cobra. Yes, lick my boots. I mean, what? I mean, what, Garrett? Nice. Thanks for the nice, nice everyone. Nice. Nice. And time for the amazing ending. Nice. Where Mega Man walks home. A very, a very long walk home that takes over a year. And you know what? For this victory, I deserve a muffin. According to the rare Super Adventure of Rockman, Dr. Raleigh didn't build a Mega Man 3 Robot Masters. He got the plans from an alien, Rob Moon. Maybe the... Maybe the Darkness Generator came from him, too. Ooh. Remembering everyone along the way? Yes. Alright, so my thoughts on this hack. 5 out of 5. Sorry I missed your thoughts. I have you on mute right now. 
That's okay, I'm actually just starting them now. <laughs> um, my thoughts on this? Five out of five. Would play this again. Was trying to watch Tom do a hard battle on FF4 Ultima. Oh, which fight is he doing? Alright, so, five out of five. The sliding and charging mechanic work perfectly as they do in Mega Man 3 and 5. Both of them are definitely a game changer. The, sli the sliding definitely helps speed things up in going through some of the stages. Through some of the stages. The Mega Buster Charge is definitely more of a game game changer since you can knock off the Robot Masters and maybe four or five sh four or five Mega Buster shots as we saw during the boss rush. And you can knock off most of the Wily bosses easily too. Except for Alien Riley, except for Alien Riley, and most likely the Blue Beams. No problem, Kuja. I really appreciate you you popping in here too. All right. So after the credits here. I'm going to switch over and try something with the with um, PlayStation Strider quickly before we call it a night. <laughs> 